In this video, I'll show you how to create a first order discount in WooCommerce in just a few simple steps. So without further ado, let's get straight into it. Okay, so the first step is to head over to WooSuite.com. Go ahead and download the dynamic pricing and discount rules plugin by WooSuite. Once you've done so, let's head back over to our dashboard. I'll leave the link in the description below. Okay, so here we are in our WordPress dashboard. So now the second step, assuming you've downloaded a dynamic price and discount rules plugin, is to go ahead and upload that plugin. So you want to navigate to plugins, add new, go ahead and upload and install the file in which you've just downloaded. Once you've done so, you'll see this wee sweet menu here. Go ahead and activate your license key. Once you've done so, it will automatically redirect you to this add-on section. Okay, and then from here, you can go ahead and activate the dynamic pricing and discount rules plugin. Just go ahead and toggle this to on, and then we can go ahead and click manage to head over to our main settings area. And I've opened it in a new tab here. Okay, so before we actually go ahead and create a rule, first I need to go over a few things. So currently I'm logged in as admin, and if we visit my account page here, you can see that I've already got an order placed. So if I was to try and uh, redeem this coupon, it wouldn't work for me. So throughout this video, when we're doing our testing, I'll test it as admin and I'll test it as a guest user using a um, unique email address to show you um, the first time order discount applying as it should. Okay, so with this plugin, we can create numerous different rules. So we can create buy one, get one free. We can create bundled um, offers. We can create tiered pricing. We can create volume based pricing and so much more different rules. But for this example, I'm going to create a simple but popular and effective promo strategy. So I'm going to say if a user spends over $100, we'll give them 10% off their purchase. And this will only apply to first time buyers only. So to do this, we'll stick to this tab here where it says order total and I'll go ahead and add a new pricing group. You can add multiple different rules targeting different buyers. Okay, so we just give this one a name. So where it says admin title, we just give it a name and it's just for internal purposes only. So I'm just gonna say spend over $100 first time buyer or something like that. Okay, and then where it says quantities based on, so I'm gonna go ahead and select um, cart total. If you wanted as well, if you wanted to restrict this rule to a particular category. So for example, if it's a retail store, you can say spend over $50 in the accessories categories and we'll give you 5% discount. But in this example, I'm going to say spend over $100 throughout the entire store and you'll be able to redeem that 10% um, discount. So I'm going to select this to cart total. And then here where it says apply to, I'm going to set this to apply to everyone. But then here where it says first time buyer, I'm going to enable this option, meaning that the rule will only apply to first time buyers only. Okay, so the minimum amount that they need to spend is a hundred dollars and the max order total. I'm going to set this to, we don't want a max on there. So we'll set it to unlimited using the asterisk sign. It wouldn't make sense to put a cap on the order total because you, you want to encourage users to spend as much as possible. Okay, so we'll say 10%. So if they spend, so the rule reads, if they spend over $100, they will get a percentage discount of 10%. Okay, so I'm just going to go ahead and hit save changes here. Okay, and then I'm going to go ahead and try and redeem this offer as admin. So let's add another one. And that should be £110 in my case, I believe. Okay, we've got a few other stuff in our basket. Okay, but you can see there's no discount um, currently being applied to it for us. Okay, and that's because we've already made a purchase before, so we're no longer a first time buyer. Okay, so let's go ahead and test this as a guest user. That's not in our database. So let's go ahead and open up a private browser, paste in the shop page, and then let's add a few products to cart. Okay, this is fine. So 120 pounds, right? So let's go ahead and check out. Okay, because at this point, the system doesn't know whether you are an existing customer or a new customer. So it will check um, based on the email that you enter in the system. So let's go ahead and just add a test um, at test.com. Okay, see, so now that it's checked our email address, you can see that the discount here is being applied. So instead of it being 105, now it's 94. And again, this ain't the only type of offer you can create. You can create numerous different um, first time buyer offers. The concept's exactly the same. And that's how you create a WooCommerce first order discount in just a few simple steps. If you enjoyed this video, please like and subscribe for more videos like this. And if you've got any questions, leave it in the comment box below or reach out to support and we'll get back to you as soon as possible.